Gentlemen, good afternoon. Welcome to the PNP send-off ceremony for Typhoon Egay Relief Operations in partnership with the STF Alalayang Aguila. One nation, one mission, one eagle with the Chief PNP Police General Benjamin C. Accorda Jr. Ladies and gentlemen, let us all rise for the invocation to be delivered by Colonel Jaime Serrano III, Officer in Charge, Chaplain Service. Let us acknowledge the presence of God and offer our prayer. As we gather here for our Typhoon Igai Relief Operation in coordination with ISTF Alalayan Aguila, send off ceremony. We pray, Lord, that may the significant journey ahead be filled with light, love, and peace. Grant all those who are part of this endeavor the strength and the courage to face any difficulties that may come their way. May these brave men and women find joy in being a part of this challenging activity. And Lord, as we entrust unto you these men and women, may they find solace in knowing that life is a tapestry of joy and sorrow, and that its thread contributes to the beautiful and intricate design of our human existence. May this activity empower us to be the beacon of hope and inspiration, especially to those who got affected by Typhoon Igai. With gratitude for the time we have this afternoon, we now entrust unto you the success of this mission. All this we pray in your mighty name. Amen. Please be seated. And now, ladies and gentlemen, let us hear the opening remarks of the Director, Directorate for Police Community Relations, Major General Edgar Allen Ugubo. Thank you. Our Chief Philippine National Police, Police General Benjamin C. Acoda Jr., sir. Likewise, the Director of the Police Community Affairs and Development Group, Police Brigadier General Lou Evangelista. We also have here our Acting Director, Police Security Protection Group, Police Colonel Rogelio Simon. The RSSF Commander, Police Brigadier General Marcelo Dayak, sir. The Deputy Director, DPCR, Police Brigadier General Arnel Amor Libetzer. The XO DPCR, Police Brigadier General Jonathan Cabal. The OIC of the Chaplain Service, Police Colonel Father Jaime Serena III, Father. Likewise, from our Brother Eagles, Governor Eagle Emilio Ramon Ejercito, sir. The Chairman of the Special Task Force, Alalayang Aguila, Triple D Chairman, Eagle Joseph Ryan Hoxon. <laughs> Chairman, National Alalayang Aguila, Eagle Jovinal Asis. Governors of the different districts of Fraternal Order of Eagles. Other guests. Mga ate at kuya. Other officers. The division chiefs of the DPCR. Our RSF members. Members of the Special Action Force. Magandang hapon po sa ating lahat, sirs and ma'am. There is a known saying which goes, In every crisis, there is an opportunity. The ravage of Typhons, Egay, and Falcon left a destructive mark on the lives of our kababayans. 
But those for us who were unharmed, the incident presents itself as an opportunity to come together in the spirit of camaraderie, unity, and kinship. Aligned with the Chief PNP's Five Focus Agenda on Community Engagement, the PNP continuously carries out initiatives in collaboration with the community's active involvement. Last July 28 of this year, we sent 2.8 million worth of relief goods, which all came from the different stakeholders of the Philippine National Police. Today, we welcome and acknowledge the generosity of Alalayang Aguila and the Regional Eagles Coalition for stepping, stepping forward in providing relief assistance to our fellow countrymen. This organization has also been our partner during my time as the director of the Special Action Force, wherein SAP and Eagles Club brought tons of relief goods to Misamis Oriental and Occidental during the destructive flash caused by Shearline and left our Kababayans no home at the eve of Christmas. They have also been valuable partners in delivering essential services to the geographically isolated and disadvantaged areas, particularly in Sitchimapedia, Gialtino, Nebeixija. Together with our RPSB personnel, the Eagles traverse steep roads, rivers, and seemingly impossible terrains just to reach the area and be able to bring hope and good governance to the people. These are the people who were deprived of the basic services of the government because the government itself find it hard to reach them. When we in the government have handicaps, you were ready to fill in the gaps. In these challenging times, the true strength of a community is exemplified to the boundless generosity and support we extend to our fellow Filipinos. Today, we stand united to provide much-needed assistance to our Kababayans in the provinces of Cagayan, Ilocos Norte, Elocusur, Benguet, Abra, Tarlac, and Pangasinan. Our collective efforts reflect the spirit of Bayanihan that has always been at the core of our nation's identity. In partnership with the PNP, I am proud to share that the Alalayang Aguila has shown exceptional dedication in collecting and donating relief goods that will make a profound impact on the lives of those affected. Through them, we are sending relief goods worth 2.5 million pesos for the food items. This, <laughs> this act of kindness rippled through our communities, reminding us of the power of collective action in times of adversity. Therefore, I implore everyone to let us carry the spirit of Bayanihan in our hearts as we embark on this mission of compassion and assistance through our combined efforts. We are not only extending a helping hand, but also planting the seeds of hope and resilience in the lives of our Filipino fellow Filipinos. Maraming salamat po sa inyong dedikasyon, malasakit at pagmamahal sa ating bayan. Together, let us continue to uphold the values of unity and service that define us as Filipinos. Welcome to the PNP stand-up ceremony for Typhoon Egay Relief Operations in partnership with STF Alalayang Aguila. Again, magandang hapon po sa inyong lahat. Thank you very much, sir. Let us now proceed to the blessing of goods and personnel. May we request Colonel Jaime Serrano III for the blessing. And may we request everyone to please rise. Let us pray. 
Heavenly Father, we come before you with hearts full of gratitude and love for our brave troops and partners of those who work tirelessly to ensure the safe passage of goods. We ask for your divine protection and guidance upon them. May you surround our troops and our partners with your shield of strength, courage, and wisdom. At the stand of the front lines, grant them courage in times of fear, comfort in times of loneliness, and hope in times of uncertainty. As goods are transport, transported and distributed, we pray for your hand of provision and safety. Bless those involved in this logistics distribution that may be efficient and effective in their work and mission, ensuring that the time arrival of these essential supplies to those in need. As I bless them with this holy water who reminds of baptism and protection from any danger. Right now, our priest from chaplain service will go down and bless our personnel. And may we request the Chief Philippine National Police to join our priest from chaplain service together with TDPCR, Director PKG, other senior officers, and visitors from fraternal or order of vehicles. the Philippine National Police, and the Fraternal Order of Eagles. Philippine Eagles Incorporated collaborate on a relief operation for families affected by Typhoon Egai. One nation, one mission, one eagle. We would like to request our Chief of PNP together with the senior officers of the PNP and our visitors from Eagles to please go back to your respective seats as we continue our program. Thank you. May the Almighty God bless you, protect you, and guide you always as you serve and country and our countrymen in the name of the Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit. Amen. Good luck and Godspeed. Please be seated. And now, ladies and gentlemen, as we continue our program this afternoon, let us hear the message of Eagle Nelson A. Serafuddin, National President, the Fraternal Order of Eagles. Uh, una sa lahat, uh, audio billahi min ha-saytan ni Rajim, Bismillahirrahmanirrahim, Bismillahirrahmanirrahim, Assalamu alaikum, Maramatullahi wa Barakatuh. Acknowledge ko muna itong mga magagandang lalaki, mga general. Dito po ang ating uh, PNP Chief, Kuya General Benjamin Acorda Jr. Sir, Kuya, gandang hapon po. Lahat ng mga General, uh, magandang hapon po sa inyong lahat. Mga Governors, lahat ng mga Governors na tumulong sa Alalayang Agila Task Force, EGAI. Mga Kuya, mga Ate, Bunso, Friends of Eagles, Magandang hapon po sa inyong lahat. Ito naman na uh, the Fraternal Order of Eagles, Philippine Eagles Incorporated. Palagi po kami tumutulong. Hindi po kami nagsasawa, lalo-lalo na itong mga 
officers ko, mga governor, lahat ng governors, 330 regions ay umalalay sa ating uh, kapulisan. Ito, puntahan namin sa lugar na Cagayan, sa Cagayan, Tarlac, Ilocos, Benguet, almost 3 million pesos po yung uh, ibibigay po namin na relief goods sa mga tao nangangailangan lalo-lalo na ito sa mga liblib na lugar. Kaya mga kuya, sana hindi po tayo magsawa na tumulong sa kababayan natin. Yan ang palagi sinasabi ng natin, mahal na Pangulo na Presidente Bongbong Marcos, si Kuya Bongbong Marcos, na sinabi na I'm proud to be a member of the Fraternal Order of Eagles, Philippine Eagles. Sinabi na po yon, I'm also a kuya. Kaya yung alala ng agila, palagi po tumutulong kakbay ng gobyerno. Ito mga governors, we are law-abiding citizen. <laughs> Hindi ibig sabihin, agila tayo, nagyayabang. Dapat magpakumbaba tayo. Yung ano bang maitulong natin sa kababayan natin. Yun lang po. Hindi ko napabayan yung salita ko. Maraming pa magsasalita. Maraming maraming salamat po. Mabuhay ang agila! Maraming maraming salamat, Sir Nelson Sarapudin, sa inyo pong patuloy na pagtugon at pagsuporta sa serbisyong nagkakaisa ng Philippine National Police. Mari na po tayong umupo. As we continue, ladies and gentlemen, we are privileged to hear the send of message of the Chief of the Philippine National Police, General Benjamin C. Accorda, Jr., Mangyaring uh, umupo, Troop Commander, give your troops to Kaspay nga. Bago ang lahat, nais kong batiin ang ating uh, mga opisyalis na nandito. The Directorate for Police Community Relations, Police Major General uh, Edgar Alan Okubo. Bok, good, morning. good afternoon. The Deputy Director for Police Community Relations, Police uh, Brigadier General Arnel Amor Libed. The Director for Police Community Affairs and Development Group, Police Brigadier General Lo Evangelista. The Deputy Director for Operations of uh, Police Community Affairs and uh, Development Group, Police Colonel Warren Gaspar Tolito. And the Chief of Director and Staff of Police Community Affairs and uh, Development Group, Police Colonel Marvin Joe Saro. The OIC of uh, Chaplain Service, our Ambassador to Heaven, Police Colonel Jaime Serena III. Of course, wala tayo ngayon dito kung wala yung kanilang suporta, the Fraternal Order of uh, Eagles Philippines with the National President, Eagle Nelson Alonto Sarapudin, sir. Magandang hapon po. Governor Eagle Emilio Ramon Ejercito. Magandang hapon po. Special Task Force Chairman, Triple D Chairman, Eagle Joseph Ryan Hoxton. The Chairman of the National Alalayang Aguila, Eagle Jovenal Asis. Yung... Uh, Secretary General ng Eagle, Eagle uh, Gregorio Pacifico. The Chairman of uh, Tribunal and Grievance for Kuya Noor Chan. Other guests, other PNP Staranka and Senior Officers, Officers, Police Dan Commission Officers, and PNP personnel from police regional offices who are watching us through Facebook Live. 
Mga ate, mga kuya, magandang hapon po sa ating lahat. The recent damage caused by Typhoon Egay in the provinces of Cagayan, Ilocos Region, Benguet, Abra, Tarlac, and Pangasinan has left countless communities shattered and in dire need of assistance. As members of this noble organization, it is our unwavering commitment to serve and protect our fellow citizens, not only during times of peace, but also amidst the most trying circumstances. In this time of adversity, we stand united, bolstered by our esteemed partners, the Special Task Force Alalayang Aguila and the Regional Eagles Coalition. Maraming maraming salamat sa ating mga ate kuya. Their unyielding support underscores the strength of our collective resolve and solidarity during times of crisis. To the dedicated personnel partaking in this relief operation, I commend your bravery, selflessness, and dedication to service. Your exemplary true essence of servicio nagkakaisa always bear in mind that you carry out not just supplies and resources, but also the beacon of hope and resilience for our people. Your presence will serve as a comforting reassurance to those who have suffered its immeasurable losses, reminding them that they are not alone in their struggles. Pag makita natin yung mga pictures, yung mga devastation, especially to our farmers, medyo masakit po, nakakalungkot po. And please give them the hope and comfort. Nevertheless, let us remi remain mindful of the challenges that lie ahead. Disaster-stricken areas often present dangerous conditions, both physically and emotionally. Exercise utmost caution and care while fulfilling your duties. Prioritizing your safety as well as that of those who are there to assist. Demonstrate empathy and compassion, and be prepared to lend a listening ear and a comforting hand to those in need. As you embark on this journey, remember that the entire nation stands in solidarity with you. We are united in this noble endeavor, working hand in hand to rebuild and uplift the lives of those affected by this calamity. Your tireless effort in this relief operation will indelibly impact the lives of the people you are about to aid. Moreover, allow me to express my heartfelt gratitude to all, all the organizations and the individuals whose generosity has made this mission possible through their donations, support, and prayers. Your benevolence exemplifies the spirit of Bayanihan, a defining character of our nation. Let us depart from this ceremony with a sense of determination, unity, and purpose. May your actions in the affected areas serve as beacon of hope, reminding our fellow Filipinos that even amidst the darkest times, the spirit of compassion and solidarity shines ever brighter. Godspeed to each one of you. May your stance, efforts in this relief operation bring much needed relief, solace, and promise of a brighter tomorrow to the communities we will touch. Maraming maraming salamat sa inyo. At magandang araw po sa ating lahat. Thank you very much to our Chief of PNP, Police General Benjamin Accorda Jr. Please be seated. 
the Philippine National Police highly appreciates the presence of our esteemed guest and would like to present a plaque of appreciation to present the plaque is Police General Benjamin Accorda Jr., Chief Philippine National Police, and he will be assisted by TVPCR, Director Pikachu, and other senior officers. Also, we would like to request Eagle Nelson A. Serapudin to please rise and to receive the plaque. Plaque of Appreciation is presented to the Fraternal Order of Eagles Philippines Incorporated, Special Task Force Alalayang Aguila, for being our ardent partner in bringing humanitarian assistance to those in need and in difficulty, particularly during a disaster. This laudable and noteworthy effort is indeed a manifestation of our parallel commitment towards public service. A warm applause, ladies and gentlemen. Likewise, Eagle Nelson Serapudin, National President of the Fraternal Order of Eagles, would like to present a token to the Chief Philippine National Police, Police General Benjamin Accorda Jr. Thank you very much. At this time, may we request the Chief Philippine National Police Together with Eagle Nelson Serapudin, National President of the Fraternal Order of Eagles, and other senior officers to kindly proceed at the lower pavement for the photo opportunity. Also, we would like to request other senior officers from the Philippine National Police to join and other officers from the Fraternal Order of Eagles to join. Ladies and gentlemen, we are now witnessing the photo opportunity with our chief of PNP together with the members, officers of STF Alalayang Aguila for the send of ceremony for Typhoon Egai relief operations. Kami po ay lubos na nagpapasalamat sa presensya ng ating Chief of PNP, Police General Benjamin Accorda Jr. at sa tulong at suporta ng STF Alalayang Aguila. Once again, thank you very much, sir. At muli magandang hapon sa ating lahat. Mabuhay ang Philippine National Police. Sama-sama po tayo para sa serbisyong nagkakaisa.